plus sparking outrage. A controversial post about the coronavirus prompts a woman who was offended to contact us. We work to get answers. An Omaha beauty salon made the Facebook post that deals with the coronavirus and the Asian community. Good evening, I'm Jennifer Griswold. The post has since been deleted by the business that initially put it up. And reporter Ruta Olsenaita spoke to the owner to see what she had to say in a story you'll see only on three. Lash Goddess on 115th and Blondo is a local spa that offers lash and spa services. But now the business is under scrutiny. A few days ago, the owner Mia Will shared a Facebook post showing a white woman giving a client a pedicure. The post says, worried about the coronavirus? Let us do your pedicures. According to the state inspector, our spa is very clean. So I think I go back to any time I was called a name. You know, it brings up that feeling. Julia Geringer's parents are from China, and when she saw the post, she couldn't believe it. She takes it as an insult towards the Chinese and Asian communities. It's not okay to think about a whole group of people in that way. The post and entire Facebook page have since been deleted. We went to Lash Goddess on Thursday to see what the owner had to say. I wanted to give you guys a chance to respond and we can come back later. Yeah, you know what, do you have your number? I would love yes, to chat with you. Absolutely. But when we stopped by later, owner Mia Will did not want to chat with us. Can I just talk to you for one second? Instead of talking, we stood locked out, even though it was during regular business hours. Standing outside, I gave her a call. Here's why she said she did not want to chat. Oh, you know what, let me go ahead and just send the statement right over. I am really not a television person. In the statement, she says, due to recent local and national media coverage about the virus, some of our clients have asked us questions about best practices in spa sanitation. Our approach in responding to those questions has been to share information about our own stringent sanitation practices and how to identify good sanitation practices in salons and spas in general. Will also apologized on Instagram via the Lash Goddess account, saying in part, I sincerely apologize to our Asian sisters and any other race who took my post as offensive. But for Julia, that's not enough. The kind of apology that says, I'm sorry if you were offended, which is a non-apology. It's, it's another thing to say, I'm sorry you were offended versus I'm sorry, I was, I was offensive. Clinical psychologist Dr. Joseph Stunko says anxiety in people plays a role in the fear factor when it comes to something like the coronavirus. But not everyone is that way. Actually, I think that's a smaller minority than, than the number of people who tend to overreact. It's important to note the coronavirus is being carefully monitored here in the U.S. and there are no confirmed cases in Nebraska at this time. Reporting in Omaha, Rudolf Sinaida, 3 News Now.